in this lesson we will learn about dummy table so this is something special in uh, hana D, hana sql hana D database so dummy table is a special one row one column table present by default in any hana system so let's see where the dummy table is lying i know where exactly it is there but uh, i'll show you the way to find if you don't know some table where it is lying so the simple select statement select star from tables if you run this statement you will see all the tables in the system so by default it is restricted to thousand rows but you can increase the row count but it is recommended to use thousand rows because if you run the select statement on big table it will run forever so you will see all the tables in the system so here we have a column called table name so let's filter with that where table underscore name is equal to dummy so my dummy table is in schema sys so let's open this schema so this is the schema and under the tables here the dummy so dummy table is a row store table you can see with the icon and if you double click the dummy there is only one column the column name itself dummy and it's a character of one length so that is dummy table so let's see the content of dummy table okay so it should be double quotes or no quotes because it's a table so select star from dummy so we have x in the dummy so what is the use of this dummy then okay let's see so the use of dummy table for example if you want to return some text in the output for example good morning if you run this then it will say good morning so you can put any text like that uh, you want to return today date so there is a function called current date it will return current date i am recording this on may 17 2017 so the current date is a function we will see about functions in coming sessions so for for now just consider you can return any function on the dummy so like that instead of current date you can use current you can call current user so right now i connected with system user so it's showing system and current time 43621 and along with current time i can use now you can use multiple columns so it's 4.36.32 a.m. Then it's showing 4.36.32 a.m. And 1.53 milliseconds. And not only functions, you can use something like 2 plus 5. Then it will give the result of 7. So like that, you can use dummy table to do some like to test some functions or something like that so that's how dummy table is very handy when you are experimenting with sql in coming sessions you will see more about dummy table how we are using in our scripting and all so there is one uh, good function i recently found which is rand rand means random 
it generates random values between 0 and 1. If I run this, so I got something 0, 0, 0. I can run this a number of times, it will change the values, but values will always less than 1, greater than 0 and less than 1. For example, if I want more than 1, then I can multiply with 9, then I will get 2, 7, 4, 8, 4, 7, 1, something like that. So we can put any value. So this rand is useful when you want to generate some data or generate some value randomly, then it's useful. So that's how dummy is handy when you are working with SQL.